Hey everyone, this is another video about uh, repairing stuff. I've already made a video about trinocular microscope. I bought uh, the same from um, Strange Part. And the thing is, the light you have uh, around your uh, actual microscope, it stopped working. So I've already teared down. As you can see, we got our uh, LEDs here. I've already checked the polarity and uh whoops anyway doesn't matter uh i know where the positive and negative and this is basically the uh board inside so if you don't remember you've got this you get you get already an ac adapter inside 100 and 240 volts and then you have the conversion here you get like the the step down uh the uh, circuits to have the 12 volt the thing is, I don't know what's going on, but it's just stopped working uh, just one day. It's like trying to have something and uh, absolutely uh, nothing was light. So the first thing I wanted to do is like troubleshooting, but honestly, I don't think it's worth it because it's like even the full, uh, if you want to buy a full uh, replacement, it's like less than 20 bucks. So honestly, I don't want to spend too much time uh, on this thing, but I still want it to be cheap. So I bought this adapter from Amazon. So if you don't know, this is uh, f uh, essentially for LED strip. So you get uh, in and out and you just uh, change the uh, variator here. And it's like the, uh, the, the potentiometer with the on off. So it's like you run off, turn it on, and then you change the uh, brightness of the light. So again, I've already turned down a part. So we get one potentiometer with the on off. And I think I would just reuse that directly. I would just remove the in and the out. Put this one. Uh, solder the on off switch, the previous on on switch, which is which was there to uh, the on off here of the potentiometer and here the potentiometer uh, the variator I'm going to reuse this one so I will just screw down exactly so I should have exactly the same uh, button in placement uh, the only uh, difference is this one won't uh, take um, AC it will be DC 12 volt DC and the good thing about that is I will be able to power the camera on top of the microscope and the light with the same alimentation 12 volt uh, DC. Uh, the only minor change is going to be uh, the DC plug uh, here and I'm going to drill and put that uh, should be working and we uh, should have like a lot of space uh, inside so let's uh, remove everything and let's do this
So let's check if it's working. I'm not convinced it's going to work because the orange wire from the switch is not linked to everything. So I'll get my 12 volt. Okay. Well, it's flickering. I don't know why. Maybe it's too low, but yeah, it's working in the... Ah, yeah, the on, 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 on switch doesn't do anything, unfortunately. So, changing plant. Uh, I don't understand uh, because this is two pole um, really uh, separate. So this is really a switch and um, the classic um, potentiometer here. So the trace here doesn't go anywhere. So I don't get it. I'm going to change that. I'm going just to have the uh, ground plane uh, link to the power switch here and this to the ground plane. So when I'm going to be there, I'm going to have a cir uh, closed circuit and then I'm going to open the ground. So let's try that again. Yeah. There you go. So I'm going to put the description in the description. Uh, this uh, this is uh, this was both on Amazon. So yeah, it's a quick fix. I uh, hope you uh, enjoy it and uh, thanks for watching.